So here's like the really fake coach. I mean, the inside doesn't even have the label, but it just doesn't feel like quality. So, I mean, if you're not touching it, it's kind of like, you know, being married and seeing a hot guy. It looks good, but you can't touch it because if you touch it, you'll feel like it's, you know, it's not real. <laughs> Let's keep looking. And we have a fake Chanel, again. No quality to the bag whatsoever. And inside is just toe up from the flow up. <laughs> okay, over here. <laughs> I don't know why all these fakes are just so horrible today. Yeah. Bad fake. I mean, for 10 bucks, you might be able to sell that for 10. Probably not because of the wear on the handles, but it's poor quality. Clothes, we find a fake Ralph Lauren. That's not the label. If you know Ralph Lauren, you know that's not the label. Plus, you could always double check over here. Um, they don't, um, they usually have a really nice label affixed to the interior bottom seam. And this one does not have a, it just has a generic kind of label. You would have like what it's made, what it's made of, and that sort of stuff. Trying to squeeze my ass into an extra large shirt is not doing me good. <laughs> it's making me very feel like a sausage, really. <laughs> yeah, we're not gonna go down there. <laughs> Roots is such a great brand, but I don't know, this is $25. I'm just like staining right here and here. I don't know if we can get that out, but I love this. It feels so comfortable, especially for like the cold months. <sighs> and it's, you know, homegrown Canadian Roots. So I just came from the shower, so my hair is a mess, as usual. It's always a mess. There we go. I want to get this. 25 bucks. It's kind of expensive. I don't know if I like the yellow. It kind of makes me look darker. Like, look at my hand. It looks like dark. <laughs> Do I look darker in yellow? Nancy told me yellow makes you look dark. And I'm kind of looking like I'm dark. <laughs> Not that it's bad, but I don't know. I'm kind of liking this. It's pink, obviously, Victoria's Secret. It's an extra, actually it's large and it fits because it stretches a lot, but it says pink here. Pink my right hair. It's cute. So I'm not wearing a supportive bra, so I'm not wearing a supporting bra. It's cute, it's a little bit faded, but I mean, it's cute. It matches my other ones, so I think I'm gonna get this. It's $15, but it's pink, pink. Uh, uh, yeah, uh. <laughs> it's only like six dollars and it's all like hand painted. You can feel like it's hand painted. It goes all the way to the back too. It's really cute. I just think it's for six bucks, so why not? <laughs> Look at that detail on that, it's really cute. These two Daniel leather bags are really cute. I don't know, that style isn't really popular right now, but 35 and 40, they the same style. I have a 30% off coupon, but let me think about it.
go. I still have that mat in that here. Let's see if they have any cool wallets. Burton Genuine Leather. that we need any more wallets or makeup bags. We have like way too many, <laughs> especially Victoria's Secret pink ones. Yeah. I'm not sure if it's authentic or not. Let me feel it. It's not authentic because you can tell by that label. Super cute. Seven bucks, Ralph Lauren Sport. Super cute. You want a hundred dollars for this fur coat? Locally made, colchin and boxer. It's really soft though. But a hundred bucks seems a little excessive, if you ask me. It's nice though. Luxurious. I don't know about the color though. It's really cute. 20 bucks. That's really cute actually. Kind of like that. Perfect for like fall. I'm really liking this a lot. <laughs> I'm just gonna try it on and see what it looks like. Can't even close it. I'm barely moving it. Okay, we are at Salvation Army. Oh, I think I have to sneeze. Oh, I hate that. When you need to sneeze and it goes away. I feel like it's like an orgasm not coming into fruition. <laughs> okay, let's go. Here we are. Let's go. This is the outfit of the day. And we're using the Tory Birch bag. Super cute. This is so cute. It's a House of Hello Birkin. It says, House of Hello, I'm not Hermes. I don't know if this is leather though. But it's super cute. It feels like leather. Smells like it. I remember Panda, Chanda, Chanda Panda, Panda Thrift. <laughs> she said that they sell really well, so I don't know. This lug is, uh, lug has not been successful for me lately, so. Pass. Oh, 
don't even know why I'm still thrifting. I have so much inventory still to get rid of. Oh, this is cute. Ew, this price isn't cute. Is this Kipling? No. If this House of Hello is leather, we're going to get it. If it's not leather, we're not going to get it. Why is this 20 bucks? Bling, Chanel, fake. It's not even like leather, it's like polyurethane. I mean, it might be good for like background decor. bucks for this juicy wristlet. That's ridiculous. Oh this House of Hello um, Hermes inspired bag. It is 100% leather, but number one, it's missing a foot. Number two, it's missing the key, like the clochette. So this can't even be unlocked. And so I think we're going to pass on it. But that is a, such a good price for this. Put it back. <laughs> Kors bag. It's a Michael Kors outlet bag and it's priced at $150. It's in excellent condition though, but that's kind of a, it's not even like an outlet price. It's like a boutique price on sale. And decided a fake Chanel. I'm gonna look inside and bother looking inside of it. This. Not really a very sellable brand for me though. I was gonna get this Victoria's Secret coin pouch, but four bucks seems a little bit expensive for that. So we're gonna put it back. And I did find this um, coach wallet, which is really cute. So we're gonna get that. Found one of these last week, and here's another one. <laughs> and I actually sold it for like 20 bucks. And again, it's a really good price. Ooh, it comes with the uh, the pouch. The other one didn't come with a pouch, so yay! $6.99, that's a good price for that. I mean, like, they like to up price their Victoria's Secret to like <sighs> a lot. 20 19 so when I find it for seven bucks, yes, please. You can never have enough Victoria's Secret totes. And you look really cute and fashionable carrying it. Number one, you get that bougie look because Victoria's Secret is expensive. Number two, it's functional. What mold can you ask for? This one's $10, but I don't know. That's too much for, oh, oh, it's brand new. $9. I don't know. Should I? Shouldn't I? It's cute. I like the pink. Now, why is this so expensive? Like, what is this? I don't understand why it's $150 for this. I mean, it's tall. That's crazy that they would price it that much. Here's a torrid um, sweater. It just says love on the front. I kind of like it. It's really cute. Very like rocker chic. <laughs> I think you're gonna get it. Hey everybody, it's Miss Philly. We are at Value Village once again. And yeah, before we get into the haul, what we purchased today, the bag owed the day is the Tory Burch Toad. I actually kind of love, oh, that guy's really cute. I really, actually really love this bag. Oh, he's like tall and manly and white skin, milky skin. Oh my God. 
Okay, <laughs> you'll probably see him walk through the window. Um, where is it? Right there. Ooh! Ooh. Um, but yeah, I haven't had a chance to clean it up, but it is in great condition. I love it. This, the leather is so soft. I already actually sold the Tory Burch Safiano bag, and I also sold the... Oh, that guy's cute, too. He's very, like, papi chulo. Oh, and a Mercedes. Ooh, CL500. There's so many cute guys. Oh, another Mercedes with a cute guy in it, too. My God, my attention is like everywhere. Hello, Papi Chulo. But yeah, so <laughs> sorry. We're using the Tory Burch tote. I actually love it. I've been. I got so many compliments on it today. And 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 and. Well, where is it? Before we get into that, I hauled something that I wanted to attach to this bag. If I use it again. Oh wow. Oh, I love I love the barrio kind of Papi Chulo, Mexicano kind of look. Sometimes it's like yeah, super cute on this bag right here you could like hang it it's like white gives and it, it, this is guest i paid like two bucks for it and it has like the guest logo the pom-pom and a little like you know crystallized key which is like super cute um right there right there Ooh, there's a sexy chocolate brother coming from that car too with the poppy chulo isn't that cuteness galore hello cuteness galore oh I have this to sit on my Depop, but if you don't buy it soon, I'm probably going to take it down. because I got lots of compliments on this bag today, and I was like, yeah, it's Tony Birch bag. Okay, let's get to the haul. Um, first things first. First things first. What did we get here? Okay, we'll go to, we'll haul what we got from here. I got this Victoria's Secret bag because I thought it was, it's brand new with tags, and it was only like a buck. So, we got it. And I love glitter and sparkle and sequin. Because it makes me look like I'm more girly and I don't have a dick. It's super, super cute. Look at that. <laughs> oh, and I'm going to get my mama to like, maybe I'm going to purchase like a button snap button closure thingy and maybe like get it so there's like secureness there. I don't know what we're going to do with that, but it's so cute. It is an open top. That was only $9. And then I got the, the poof poof charm for two bucks, which is cute. It's from Guess. And it has so many crystals. I love bling, bling, bling. And we actually, from a couple of vlogs back, maybe two vlogs back, we also hauled this exact bag, this Victoria's Secret, but I actually sold it because somebody loved it. So I sold it for 20 bucks. I think I paid the exact same amount too. I love it because you can actually secure it. And this bag can be used as like an everyday kind of tote as well. And it's Victoria's Secret. And rocking Victoria's Secret means you're girly, you're bougie, you have fashion and sense, and you are current and modern, okay? That's what Victoria's Secret says. And that's why I buy a lot of pink in Victoria's Secret. So this was like $7. And then we purchased this Coach, Coach wallet. This was, oh, why is there a hole in this? They punctured a hole. This was $6.50, but that's okay, I guess. There's a hole in it right there. But it's okay. I guess that's where they initially punctured it. Oh, there's another hole in it, right? Why would you puncture a hole like right in the leather? Like do it where there is freaking like the seam. Oh, Value Village, you're so stupid sometimes. Seriously. Sorry, Valley Village. I want to get sponsored by you and I love you and you my bread and butter and I can find a lot of hot and things there, but sometimes you'll be stupid, okay? But whatever, regardless, I'm probably going to keep this for myself and use it. It's in perfect condition aside from those holes. And it's like a cute little wallet to have when you just have like, you know, a small bag to use. And then I purchased this torrid top as you saw in this clip over here. Me being a hoe in the dressing room. I liked it because it's tor I went to the Torrid outlet, the outlet, not even like a regular Torrid, but the outlet. Hella expensive at wait, what the fuck? I'm like spitting all over myself. Hella expensive at Torrid. It's like twice the price of Pennington's, but also Torrid is more trendy. It's like basically a plus size Forever 21, but like better quality and more expensive. But yeah, like I think their deal was buy one, get one half off, and to buy one would be like a hundred dollars for their top. And then half that would be like $50. And then you're basically spending $150 on two tops. Oh, so I got this. I just thought it looked super cute and cool. It just says love because I want to find love. And this was cheap. It was only like $6.50. So, and then this was a little bit of a splur. Oh, this also came with, oh, it's a little bit dirty in here, but that's okay. Came with the pouch. The other one didn't come with the pouch, so these Tom Ford glasses eyeglasses I just thought they were so chic they are in perfect condition like the the frames and they fit so well and it's made in Italy Tom Ford 
it doesn't really say anywhere that it's Tom Ford except for like the little bit here. So it's kind of like, okay, why isn't anybody knowing that I'm wearing Tom Ford? And that's what it looked like on. I thought it looked really cute and really chic. Something aside from the basic black with the kind of, it's kind of like black with the clear um, lines through it or whatever. I just thought it was cute. Like thing here, I don't know. But they're cute. They're, these were $20, which is a steal and a half because Tom Ford eyeglasses are usually like $250, $300. So hello. Value Village on uh, Ellis. We picked up this Lululemon, Lululemon, Lululemon scuba hoodie. It's a size 12 and it's and it has this tag still attached to it, like the, the size tag. It's kind of rare to find size 12 Lululemons. Like it's really hard to find that. Like I've only come across it a few times like i could say less i can count on two hands how many times i've come across a size 12 lululemon clothes you know so it's really hard to find that and that's why i, pay, I paid for this i paid 15 dollars plus tax i like it because it's in great condition and i love that it's not just completely gray it's just there's a you know a contrast in the colors and i also look at the sleeve cuff to see if there's any fraying which it doesn't and yeah there's a little bit of peeling on it but i mean peeling can be taken off individually and it's not that noticeable it just gives it that kind of worn kind of look and you know the peeling can just be like taken off like this see you know spend time just going like this for freaking watch netflix go like this for a few hours and you're done i like it a lot of course i'm saving that for myself for the future skinny me and then Salvation Army uh, by Polo Park. We scored this awesome Lululemon gym bag. Fantabulous. It's like new condition. Like there's no scuffing on the hardware. There's no cracking on the corners. There's no wear on the bottom. Like there's like Lululemon embedded on the feet. 30 bucks. I know that's a little bit expensive, but this probably retail for like 120, 150, okay? And there's like no cracking on the handles. Oh, we'll take out everything that we got inside as well. And it also came with its crossbody strap. Perfect condition. This bag is in perfect condition. Like, not used, not used at all. Like, it's insane. Like, it's insane in the membrane. Like, there is no wear on this bag. It's like, yeah, it's like brand new. Like, the tag is still right here. Like, the, not the actual tag, but like the thing that connects the, the tab. This is brand new. Like, I'm not even kidding you. This is brand fucking new. Oh, for 30 bucks, that is a freaking deal. Like, hello, hello, teenagers. Listen to Miss Philly, okay? Miss Philly needs to be your new icon. I'm teaching you. You can be bougie on a freaking budget. You can look cool for school and not spend a fortune. Love it. Such perfect condition. Ooh, this was a score and a half. Lulu, yeah. Also, from there, we this I a little bit overpaid for again. This is a Lulu uh, hoodie, size tag, still also attached. I love the blue color of it. It's just blue. I love blue. I love blue. This was $30, but I did have a $10 off coupon, and it's in perfect condition. It's a size 12, but my only concern as well is that there is some, like, staining on the cuffs, so I'm going to try and get that out. I, I asked the lady that if I can't get out the, the, the dirtiness of the cuffs, if I can return it, she said yes. But it's not that even like noticeable unless you actually like put it under light. It's kind of like, it looks like, I don't know if it's sweat or I don't know if it's coming off on camera. Oh, right there. You can see a stain right there. But I'm going to try and wash that with my, you know, just hand wash it and see if I can get that out. If I can, then I'm keeping it because I love this color. And like, see, there's no like even, there's a size 12 again. So future sexy me. From there also was this juicy hoodie uh size extra large four bucks for this okay four bucks and it's made in america Ma so this is like their old school juicy like from back in the day like 04 06 when juicy was in <laughs> made in the u.s of freaking a and it says right here choose juicy and it's that cute little blue color oh size extra large love it we're gonna rock this bitch when i'm skinny uh-huh i don't care if i'm 40 years old i'll be rocking lulu and juicy just one little crystal missing right there <laughs> but that's okay for four bucks hello vintage juicy uh-huh okay guys that is all that we got i hope you enjoyed this video we're going to go by the uh, value village by my place and see if we find anything or we might not because it's it's late in the day and i haven't even eaten anything yet because i'm trying to be skinny and hot soon because i'm amassing a lot of cute clothes and 
and I need to fit this in there because I'm afraid that one day it's going to take way too long to lose a weight. I'll be like, I don't want to wear this shit no more. I find it cute now, so I want to wear it now. But anyway, guys, thank you for joining me today. I appreciate it. I love you. Stay positive. Stay progressive. Stay productive. Um, have a fabulous day. And thank you to all my new subscribers. I love you so much. I love doing these videos for you, and it's all for you. It's all for you. Tell me I'm the only one. Ah! Anyway, guys, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.